two neighbours you're about to meet have become bitter enemies. Their fight has put one behind bars. She's 86 and there's no truce in sight. Hoses at the ready. This is neighbour versus neighbour. This woman, look at her, look. look at her. A fight over a patch of dirt. What's wrong? Leaving a great grandmother behind bars. Yes, she is a nasty piece of work. My property. It's amazing that a neighbourhood dispute over a boundary and a fence could escalate to this. Anne O'Donnell has lived at the end of her cul-de-sac in Perth's southern suburbs for 16 years. The 86-year-old and her neighbour, Kate Wood, used to be friends. We'd just talk out there, looking at our gardens and, yeah, and shopping days I'll take her. But you wouldn't know it now. I just don't like her anymore. I can't stand her. And I think, why did I help her in the first place? Yeah. The ladies have fallen out over this, a patch of dirt on their boundary. They say that it's my property, they decide that it's her property. Kate says it's her land, but for years Anne has been watering and treating it like her own. So when grass was dug up and rubbish dumped, she saw red. I've got a sticker for myself, if I don't, who's going to? She was busted on CCTV, ripping up Kate's beloved lavender. I have no children. I treat them all my plants like my children. If any people damage my plant, I will feel very sad. I could hear her crying in there. <laughs> oh, my babies! I've got no kids. This is my baby. So why did you pull out these lavender bushes? Well, I thought, well, you did this to me. I, I'm going to pay you back. I know it's wrong. I do know that it's wrong. I should not have done it, but I just lost Nan it. And so the tit for tat began. Every time yeah. Nan's out the front, she'd come yeah. up to Nan, she's threatened to kill her. She's like, I'll kill you. I'll kill you, you know. I'll kill you, she keeps saying, and she'll come right up to my face too. Be Kelly be helps to look after time. her adopted Nan and yeah. says Kate yeah. is not a victim. She goes nuts though. Runs around the front yard with her, with her um, now they've got cameras all installed, but before that it was with her mobile phone, running around recording them. Kate's home videos have caught Anne on the attack with her garden hose one too many times, and she was arrested by police after repeatedly breaching a misconduct order. And how does that make you feel when your 86-year-old gran gets locked up? I know, who's mom? never been in trouble yeah. with the law at all until at she's 86. All. From up there... A legal aid right blunder saw the great-grandmother spend six days locked up in a maximum security jail before eventually being granted bail. A magistrate has since decided not to record a conviction, but Anne wasn't allowed home for four months. I get kicked out of my house and the troublemaker can still stay in her house. This is Anne's house and this is Kate's. Council documents back up Kate's land claim and she wants to extend the existing fence as far as possible. But Anne doesn't want to have to pay for it. So this is council land here? Yeah. We came to get to the bottom of this turf wall. And this is where she's dug it all up. One Nan hasn't been here, one Nan's been living with me. She's and right on cue, Kate emerged, camera at the ready, okay, but Kate, not happy going? to see ours. Kate, how are you going? I'm from A Current Affair. Do you mind if we have a chat about... The dispute? You cannot take a video of my home. So I will call if you know the deal. And that was pretty mild. Normally she runs around the front yard carrying on and but yeah. yeah. She did well, she wasn't too keen to talk about the actual dispute then, no, was she? No, when the cameras were rolling. No. It her. wasn't too no. long before she was back again and the garden hose was turned on us. That is my property. No. Get off! Whoa. We'd love to hear your side of the story, Kate. Can you just tell us about your concerns? What's wrong with you? Let's not be doing that. Oh, this woman. Look at her. Look. Ooh. Look at her. Look I don't at... think you should be doing that. No need to get physical. She used a water gun attack me twice. I just think she's an old person. I don't want to do anything to hurt her. But there's been a violence restraining order taken out against you too, so are you really innocent in all of this? Innocent what? There's been a violence restraining order taken out against this you. This person be arrested in the jail. 
This time, though, the police came to speak to Kate. And after a day to cool off, she asked us back to hear her side of the story. Until now, I did nothing wrong. This is the only thing that makes me feel very, very bad. If that was me carrying that thing, I would have been charged yeah, straight away and, and dragged off to jail. It's my property. Kate has documents proving the land is hers, but the fight over the fence is still before the courts. Why we need to be enemy? I never want to treat her bad. I just want she stay in her property, I stay in my her property. She'll do what she wants to do and that's it. She won't take any notice of anybody. But she picked the wrong woman to do it with, didn't yeah, she? Yeah, absolutely. Anne says she's now considering selling her home of 16 years, which mightn't be a bad idea, really.